guys, what's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rides. Basically, Happy New Year because we are counting down the last days of 2022, heading into 2023. A lot of amazing things happened in 2022. Of course, all the different new vehicles we got to drive, the crazy adventures that we went on. But at the end of the day, I know what people who are especially devoted Rady's Rides fans want to see. They want to see the bloopers. Now, yes, I do everything in one take. We are unscripted, but sometimes those things pop up which are out of my control per se. And it's one of those things that we like to hold on to those edits that have made it to the uh, cutting room floor, so to speak. And that's what we take. And then Lori gets to have, I don't know if I would necessarily say the hard task, but definitely a task, a task that she enjoys doing, which is going through all of that edited content to see what the bloopers were for 2022. We film at least one car. We put up at least one car review every single day. You know that. When we go to the auto shows, a lot of times to get that content out there while it's fresh, we will put up more than one car review per day for those particular events. So that really brings that element of bloopers into the forefront. What are those moments where, you know, I couldn't think of something, something didn't come to me, all of those kind of things. Maybe a car didn't participate in the review the way that I wanted it to happen. So here we are celebrating the incoming new year of 2023 with all of the best bloopers of 2022. So without further ado, get your Twinkies ready and get ready to have some laughs. Let's check out the bloopers. And I remember the days when Sentras and Ultimas had some some real, real performance. Navigate to, the name was not recognized. Go back, please say or select a command. I don't know what the is going on here. Leave me alone, how about that? You look at their lineup, things really changed in the year 2000. In Y2K, that was the introduction, introdu introduction. A Fisker karma? And you would be right, Fisker, when out of business has been restructured and now we have Karma as the brand, this GS6 is the model. Now, what's fascinating is that this is a battery, a battery. What is a battery? I'm going up the bat. Lift back is going to allow you to have versatility, but let me show you where your charging door is. It's actually right underneath this panel right here. You just kind of, oh, it's locked. I think it's going to be the death of me. V-Series badge, and then underneath that V-Series badge, what do we have? You have a strut top brace that's going to help stiffen up the front end that's beefier than a girdle off a girdle. <laughs> All right, guys, time to get in the cargo area. We got lots of boots. We have lots of rope, bays of hail, all sorts of things. How do we open it? No. Bays of hail? Bays of hail. What is that? Oh. Are we recording? Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rise. I'm in back. So many great models throughout their heritage, going towards luxury, going towards performance. In the 19th century, that's 19th century, this vehicle is known as the GS6. Now this vehicle is a battery, battery. Why do I keep saying battery? Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rise. We're in front of my... Uh -huh. Yes, we're in front of my house. Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rides. We're still here at the 2021 Chicago Auto Show. What? what? I say 21? Yeah. Oh, whoops. We're going back in time. That was the summer. Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rides. We're still here at the 2021. Why do I keep saying that? I don't know. I don't know either. All right, guys. I got a letter. A uh, letter. But before we get into this, Super size, grand, I was gonna call it a grand wagon here. Hey guys, what's up? Oh, never mind. You got me off my game. 
All right, guys, we're in the 2023 Honda Hornet. This one, like we're a. Not in a Honda Hornet. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and guess what? We have that one. All right, guys, back seat. Uh, sorry, messed up. My new favorite parking lot locations, just because of the nice, tranquil. Uh, uh, this is a new 2022 Range Rover Sport SVR Bespoke Edition. It's Bespoke Edition. On both sides, the fold down the rear seats, and we have that Harman Kardon subwoofer, but watch how easy it is. One, two, three. I'm gonna go ahead and push. What the f It's f hanging up on the seat belt. Oh, now it goes down, huh? You All right, guys, it's been one type of getty up kind of day here at walker ford i definitely want to thank frank walker weston walker tracy mark benji benji's not even here now i know you're saying to yourself well joe i've seen some of the higher trims and i've seen some of the hybrid versions but how much is this xl with the ecoboost well i'm here to tell you you go optional ecoboost power and stick with an xl trim you're gateway into the maverick world you're looking at a msrp of twenty five thousand, which i just f***ed up but before we get into this four by four full-size truck let's talk about what's going on here the full-size truck segment is all right guys we got a hood wait never mind we got a hood we got a hood but you know what there's another compact sports performance vehicle that came out during the 1980s that was all about sports injected. What vehicle is that? The SI, the Mighty Civic SI. So what I want to find out is, has Honda done enough? Because this is not a Honda and I just <laughs> that up. Because guess what? We have that one mid-engine car people won't stop talking about. This is it. This is a 22, 22. Yeah, it's a 2022. This is a 2022 Cadillac CT5V Blackwing. But before we get into this rear wheel drive supercharge with a slick shifting six speed manual transmission, let's talk about what's going on here. Cadillac, they are going. What? Ah, f I don't know. F hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Radio from Radies Rise. We're back here at Tampa Honda, of course. Like we say in Tampa. This is the vehicle that really ushered in a lot of what you see design-wise amongst the different Nissan vehicles like the Maxima, the Sentra, and the Versa. I got a bug on me. After searching and searching and searching, we didn't get up. Get up. All right, guys. Backseat. Uh, Backseat time. I'm in the front hey guys what's up it's joe Rady from Rady's rise we are here in the detroit suburbs right on the outskirts outskirts i have a performance suv that might blow you away when it comes to i don't know that ain't gonna blow you away this is a ct4v blackwing but before we get into this twin turbocharged carbon fiber aero equipped sedan let's talk about what's going on here Cadillac is really making a real loud yell. I don't like that. That sounds stupid. All right, guys, we got the hood popped up. Uh, hood popped. Pup, pup, pup. SR trim, and it's an all new color called. What's the color? Sonic Sky. Pearl. No, Sonic. Don't say Sonic. Now you're going to confuse me. Sky. Sonic Great Pearl is Honda. Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Rady from Rady's Rides. We're actually in a new filming spot location for a good reason. It's this vehicle right here. This is the changed up, updated 2023 Nissan. I almost said Maxima. This particular one is the SR trim, but it's got the more powerful VC turbocharged engine. But before we get into this midsize sedan with a new color called Gray Pearl no, gray sky pearl. Gray sky pearl. It is. But before we get into this little bit more powerful 
mid-size sedan in a new color for 2023. It's called Gray, gray Sky. <laughs> <laughs> So as you can see, guys, we like to have a lot of fun here on Radies Rides, and I love sharing the laughs and, of course, the bloopers for 2022 with you. Now, if you have not seen the bloopers from last year, or maybe you just want to relive those laughs, I will leave the link for the 2021 bloopers at the end. As we're wrapping up this review, click that link, and you can watch the bloopers from last year. But Obviously, we are heading towards 2023. We got the 1 million subscriber celebration coming up. Stay tuned for that, but also stay tuned. The next two days, we have some exciting 2022 stuff. I have my top 10 cars for 2022 review, and then also the top 10 SUVs and trucks for 2022. So you don't want to miss that coming up the next couple days. And if you're new to this channel and you're wondering who the heck is this guy, I gotta watch more, hit that subscribe button. I promise you it's worthwhile coming back for more. If you are a subscriber, thank you. This has been a great year, 2022. Lots of laughs, lots of cars. Thank you for being a subscriber. Of course, we gotta thank Lori, setting up this little filming station in my office and making sure to put together the bloopers because she knows that she likes to laugh at me but you guys want to have some laughs as well. So thank you, Lori, for sharing the laughs and all that you're doing. Just like always, guys, I'll see you on the next ride.